Hello. Hello. Hey, what's up? How's it going, Rev? Who is this I'm speaking with? Is this Johnny? Uh, yeah, this is Johnny. I just just got back from Colorado. I told you this I would is give you a call. Oh, yes, I need to speak with you. Are you there by yourself right now? I need to speak with no, you. No, uh, Lucille's here, but she's not paying attention. She's just watching her show. Um, what did okay. you need to talk about? So what's, what's wrong with your phone? Listen, because I'm working on you. I'm working on some spells here to get you guys protected because, as I said the other day when you guys were on your vacation, I felt a bit disrespected, so I had to stop doing what I was doing because my spirits don't work with bad energy. Oh, okay, right. So the negativity. Yes. Yeah, yeah, so I need to, to, to do it back. So both you and I, man to man, I'm going to need to have an open line of connection with you. So... Uh, uh, the hacker is that camp. I, I I got some information, so I'm gonna be working on getting back those gold for you, okay? But the first thing of order, you guys are gonna to need to listen to me because if you guys had had listened to me a week ago, everything could have been stopped. But because I was warning, if you look at the text messages in her phone, I texted her days before, telling her that listen, something is wrong. And then she told me to leave her family, family alone. Yeah, she's well, we're on vacation, vacation, you know. Uh, yeah, you know. Uh, so I know, I know. But I was still trying to let you guys know what was going on because you left me in charge and said, listen, Goldstein, look out for Johnny. Look, uh, look out for Mikey. And you, you know Mikey doesn't listen. Mikey is a bit stubborn. I'm a guy, yeah. I'm going to tell the truth. Even if, even if you guys don't like the truth, I'm going to tell you the truth. Now, listen. Have, have you been feeling what I want okay to do, today? I, if I've been feeling okay. Yeah, you've been feeling all right. Yes, I'm I'm a bit down in the spirit, but uh, God is good, so I can't complain. But we need to get things going, and we need to get you guys straightened out and protected, okay? Well, I think we're going to be okay. We just decided we're just going to we're going to change all our numbers, and when we move to Colorado... Yes. We're not going to keep in contact with anybody, so we'll be okay. We don't have to whip no voodoo on us if you don't want to. Yeah. That's, hey, Johnny, that's what Johnny, I was... who are you talking to, baby? Who are you talking to? Uh, it's Reverend. He's. We're just having a man-to-man -man talk here about, about protections, you know, taking care of the family, you know, men stuff. That's not man stuff. I can do that, too. That's just so sexist. I hate hearing that. That's so sexist. Well, that's not how we meant it. We're just talking about things that you're not interested in, you know, like... Protecting well, give, the family? I give her an example, Reverend. So how was vacation? So how was vacation? Oh, it was great. And we got to see mm -hmm. the family I've never oh. seen before, so it was pretty good. And what, which which hotel did you stay at? Uh, well, we stayed with the family. We We only stayed once at a... Oh, I think it was called Pegasus or something. Uh, I can't remember, but uh, we got I got Lucille to try some of that conch. She said she didn't ever think she would want to try that, so we got to try a bunch of stuff that, you know, you can't get here in Texas. Yeah, it was nice. Yeah, I mean, it looked like a gigantic oyster, she says. It was a big, slimy, gigantic oyster, but you know what they say. It's, oysters are almost like eating a booger out of your nose. It's kind of disgusting <laughs> texture to it, but okay. it's so yummy. Okay. Yeah. So so when are you when are you planning to move to Colorado? Oh my gosh, uh, we we're gonna how long do you think it'll take us to sell everything, sweetheart, that that we're not taking with us. I mean I know you it's going to be a little while. It's not, it's, it's a, not a small undertaking. I know that. I know you don't want to get rid of your some of your Appaloosas and some of the your favorites, but probably take a couple months or so to get everything ready. Mm -hmm. Depends on how we sell the place. If we sell turnkey with everything here except for what we want to take with us, it could go pretty Maybe quick. in about a month or two? Yeah, probably with mm -hmm. it. For sure, within okay. a couple of months. Right. That sounds good. That sounds good. Well, what are you talking about, the uh, gold? What did you find out about 
Alex. Okay, well, I have some and information. Thanks, I have some, some, some guys in the Homeland Security. They're working on it for me. They're going to run it. In, they're running. They're, they started an investigation. The Homeland Security. They started with the you, FedEx. You work with yes, Homeland I Security. Yes, I have some connections in there. I thought you was just a. I thought you was just a shaman. What, yes. what are you doing Homeland working Security. with the government? I have friends. I have I have friends in high places. I have friends in high places. Oh, I got friends in high places. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> I have friends. Right. I have friends in both high and low places. Uh, but you, I had to pull out all the stops for you guys to get things going and to find out what's going on. You know. Mm. All right. Well, what did you find out? Because we haven't heard anything yet from the people on our end that's investigating it. They just, to be honest, they uh, kind of uh, until they can figure out some cer certain things, they're not going to be able to tell us a whole lot. So what people do you guys have on it? Oh, well, the FBI. Remember, I told you that they... Every time uh, they try to steal something from us, they open up a case. So, of course, they're looking into all the things that Mikey did while he was, while we were on vacation. So, hey. they won't tell us nothing. We don't have any friends in those kind of high places, no. do we? He did. He did say I, he called today, Jenny. I forgot to tell you. He said that they found some new information about some new players and all of this. But he said he was trying to keep it. You know, he couldn't give me all the details. But he said they found new players on in their involved in this. Interesting. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. What is your What's your information telling you, Ever? Yes. Where are they from? Where are they from? The FBI. They found in the, the new league guys. They found. Where are they from? Oh, they won't. They won't tell you that kind of information right in the middle of the. Yeah, he wouldn't give me any details. He just said he found out there was some new players involved, and it was, and they were um, hot on their trail, basically. And I don't know, but they, he just wanted to keep me updated. I forgot to tell you, Danny. I'm sorry. Oh, that's all right. I was. I heard they were from Costa Rica. I heard all the guys were from Costa Rica. Oh, man, I didn't hear nothing like that. That, that's what your people yeah. were saying. Mikey didn't say anything about sending anything to Costa Rica, but that's possible. No. That, yeah, Costa Rica? I from. yeah, I remember that one lady he was talking to that said she was from Brazil. Did he tell you about mm -hmm. Lisa? Mm -mm. No. Those are just hackers, and some of them are hackers and, 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 and men pretending to be females. All right. Well, there's definitely some hackers involved. But, uh, well, what I want you to do, I want you to buy a new cell phone. You're going to buy Mikey a new phone with a new phone number. What? Well, that's, uh, I mean, yeah, probably will when we get to Colorado. No, but... that's, that's going to that's gonna take a while. I want you to do it in, before the week is over. I need you guys to get two new phones, okay? Two new okay, cell phone Mr. numbers. Okay, Mr. Goldstein, are you going to give us the money for it? Are you going to uh, give us the money for these new phones? Are you just barking orders? Get these phones. Do it right now. Do it right now. Really? No, I'm not barking. I'm not barking any orders. I'm just telling you what the spirits are telling me to keep you guys protected and out of the reach of these unscrupulous criminals. Oh, you're going with and the spirits. I'm not, I'm not here to argue with you guys. I'm not here to argue with you guys, bark any orders. What I'm, listen, I have never spent a dollar out of you guys' money. I have never asked you guys for a red cent. What I'm doing is out of my love of my heart and for Johnny, okay? So don't think that I am doing this. What about the money you asked for? What about the yeah, money you asked for money from him? That I did. Yeah, I didn't sure ask does Mikey. Count. Yes, it does. Sweetheart, mm -hmm. I didn't ask Mikey for any money. The, yes, the hackers you did. that were on the line. Listen, listen. The Johnny, hackers I'm that were. It. I'm going to lose it here if he keeps lying. I'm going to lose it. I'm not I'm lying. Gonna lose it. And if I'm lying, Johnny. God can strike me here. Listen. Well, let's hear what he's saying. Are you saying that? That wasn't you, Mikey, was talking to? That he was talking to another, no, reverend? Not reverend, another reverend? I spoke to I spoke to Mikey, but listen, the hackers are on Mikey's phone. They have a remote access on the phone by the name of any desk. So whatever I and Mikey talk about, if I call Mikey now on the phone and speak to Mikey, when I hang up, the guys are still on the line and they pretend to be Mr. Goldstein. Okay? No, they're not. 
they're not. They're not. You know why they're they not? They're, you know why they're not? Because I deleted that app off of, off of Mikey's phone. So that's that's not When true. was that? That's not happening. When did you delete the app? When did you delete the app, sweetheart? A few days ago. Huh? That that yeah, that, that was a few days ago. ago. And when did Mikey send all the money? Mikey sent all the money last week. The app was on the phone the entire time. Oh, yeah, we know. What, we I texted know what you guys. Yes, yeah, I texted but... you guys and told you. So last week when I was trying to prevent Mikey from doing all that, every time I tell Mikey, don't do that, someone else calls Mikey, interrupt on the phone, pretending to be I, Mr. Goldstein, telling Mikey to do this, telling Mikey to do that. A guy by Mr. Bear, he's the one behind all of this. The guy by Mr. Bear. That's the guy that took all Mikey's money. And I'm trying to explain to you guys, I told you, if I ever spend a red cent out of you guys' money, God could strike me dead right here. I have never spent not hope. even a dollar out of your money, okay? Well, what are you, what is, is this, uh, this is your phone number you're on this right now, This is the office right? phone number. This is not my personal line. But, yes, this number, you can reach me on this number. That's correct. Right. Well, this is this is the phone that you is sending Mikey messages on. The guys this are number. on the phone. Are you saying you're not the one that sent these no, texts to? No, no. I... Something about you're gonna you're gonna send the spirit to bind his legs. That's right, not I you. I sent that message. I sent that message. That was the day Mikey was trying. Who to who who threatened who threatened my son? Who who did that? Johnny Goldstein. I did that. that. Yes, Why? because Mikey was yeah, sending should... out because Mikey was going to send out the gold bars, and I was telling him I'm going to let you stay. I'm going to bind your legs so you stay at the bar so you can't send any money to the cameras. And he was like, "Don't do that! Don't do that!" So I lifted all the spells and left him to do anything he wanted to do. So that's why he okay, went and said, "Do me a favor! Do me a favor! Cripple his legs? I didn't say cripple his legs. I didn't say cripple. I did. I didn't say cripple his legs. I didn't say cripple his what is, well, what does the bind what does the bind his legs mean? Does that mean he can't walk? No, sweetheart. Look still no, no, you guys are not listening. I said bound his leg. I I didn't well, say to Mikey. You. Mikey know what I meant. I said I was going to bound his legs so he couldn't leave to go send these guys any money. Okay? But you don't do ma you don't be doing magic on my son. Well, why are you asking him to send money? To I, I told him I'm not going to let him send any money. I was telling him I am not going to let him send any money to the cameras. And then you guys told me to... Well, no, no. No, I'm, I'm re sitting here reading it, Mr. Goldstein. Pardon me? You asked him, ask him to send money to a guy named Mario. No, no, I did not. That was... Mario? That was that was that was, Luigi's brother? Is that Luigi's brother? Uh, yeah, I don't know. It might be Luigi's brother, but it, you told him to. He said, "Make sure you send the packages to Michael." And that, it's, it's right here. You you ask him to send the packages to Michael, and what was in those two packages that uh, going to Michael? Nothing went to Myra and my and, and Mario. Listen. Then why you, you ask him to have... do it? Why did you Listen. ask him to do that? That wasn't me. You guys need to listen. You guys need to listen, okay? The messages, the messages that are sent. Listen, I'm going to give you guys knowledge now, okay? The remote access software that was on Mikey's phone, these guys have access to Mikey's photos. They have access to Mikey's messages and phone logs. These guys know that you left me in charge to make sure Mikey didn't do anything. So those guys... They used that against Mikey. They have those messages that you're seeing in the chat. Those weren't sent by me. Those were sent by Mr. Beer. Mr. Beer can send any message, okay. delete uh, okay. any message. Uh, all right, all right. So all right. he's I'm framing sorry. me. I'm, sorry. I'm not stupid. Okay, can Mr. I please say something? Bear? Can I interject here? Because I think I think that I think you're wrong about that. You can't. You can spoof a telephone number, but once one person has already called you, like you have already contacted our son. If there's a text message sent, it's coming from you. It is not coming from no. anybody else. All right, listen, listen. The guy, he controls the entire phone. Mr. If you guys look at the text messages, 
a guy named Mr. Bear was texted on the phone. So I'm explaining to you that with the remote access by the name of any desk, and the person that puts the, 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 the software on Mikey's phone, they could text, call, delete, and put any messages. So what the guys do, the receipts that Mikey sent those guys, they deleted all their messages, and they put the messages that makes it look like I, the go, I Mr. Goldstein, was oh, the sure. one that, take, that, that took the money. Hmm. You don't know Mario. No, no, those people. No, mm. so the money people. was sent to David and a guy by the name of David and, and Mr. Bear. Mr. Bear, those are the, the mastermind behind. Well, all of I this. see the I see David on here, but I also want to see where you ask someone to send forty thousand dollars to Wells Fargo. No. Listen, that's 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 that's. So all that, these all these times that you asked my son to send money with somebody else, it was never you. Wasn't you? No, Maggie, wasn't no that you? wasn't me. Wasn't you? Okay. That wasn't okay. me. Listen, listen. Look at this one, honey. It says, can't let him figure out. That's good. We need to keep oh. Mikey broke. Let's mail 100K. Let's mail 100K in the metal oh. thermos, and I'll have a Wells Fargo to put a 40K oh. into. Oh, my God. All right. Does that look, so why would I send a message like that to Mikey? Does that make sense? Well, it doesn't look like it's, it looks like it's to somebody. Who else would be sending these Alrighty. messages? Alrighty, that's what I'm saying. The hackers are on the line, and they text what they want to text. So they put in the text, and they put in the information well, to make it look like us. They deleted all the information. That all, that all accounts, that accounts almost for all the money that... Pardon that me? he lost. It says 200 k to Mario, one hundred k to to wow. PNC Bank. Then you got more money hmm. sent to this Michael and his bro. Oh no, it's just good. Let him send it. FedEx All right. If you overnight. guys, if you guys want to know, listen, listen. If you guys want to know, mm. go to the FedEx with Mikey. If you guys want to know where the gold sent, I can prove it to you. Go to the FedEx with Mikey. And you you check up all the addresses where Mikey sent the the the, the, the boxes and the thermoses. Go and check for yourself. Well, it looks like someone's deleted most of the addresses in here. I Those are deep card messages. I, Those are deep card messages. I don't see a name, Listen. except for a first name for these people. So. Those are th Mario? those are deep card messages. Him? Those are fake people. The real, the real persons are at FedEx. Those are decoy messages, okay? Decoy messages. Decoy yes. messages. Yes, those are the fake people. They call Mikey and they mm. give Mikey the wow. name to, they are to send it to. Well, this looks like stuff that looks like stuff that you would be saying. It says like, um, you the lights are dimming. You need to jump up and down and turn circles, clapping your hands and stuff. Uh, isn't that some of your, your spirit talker? I was the one that sent that one. But listen, Johnny, are you understanding me? Well, I don't understand what does clapping three times and spinning clockwise Mikey was do. saying something with... What are they doing, the hokey pokey? What are they doing, the hokey pokey? Uh, I don't know. It says, Mikey said his text is still on here. It says... Am I supposed to jump up and down while I'm clapping? Oh. Um, did you manage to get the spirits out of the air conditioner? Spirits out of the air conditioner. Well, Mikey says the lights dim when the air conditioner kicks off, but I think that's more because of that bad breaker out there than uh, spirits, mm -hmm. don't you? What have you been doing? Have you, you and Mikey been doing black magic out there in the office? Pardon me? You and Mikey been practicing magic out there in the office, or what have y'all been doing while we was gone? No, I read some scriptures. I read some scriptures with Mikey, and I taught him a few things. But listen, you guys... You can't teach him more than I've taught him. You can't teach him more Pardon? than I've taught him. No. Was it biblical? Was it biblical I did some scriptures, with him. or I was you... Some, I did some priors with him. I did some priors with him. Oh, okay. All right. Well, you know what, Tony? Right. You know what? You know what? I'm going to do. I'm going to consult my rooms here. 
I'm going to consult my rooms about this whole situation and about Mr. Goldstein. See if there's any deception going on. You know what rooms are. All right. Just All right. This is the last thing I'm going to say to you guys. Are you hearing me? Yeah, mm -hmm. that's great. All right. Go so ahead. I want both you and Lucy to listen to me for just two minutes and let me speak, okay? Mm -hmm. I'll go ahead and read my rooms here while you're doing that. Go ahead. All right. No problem. No, no problem. When the entire mm -hmm. thing started, Johnny, I was here, and, I, and when you guys were on vacation, I texted Lucille, and I told her that something was going on, right? Are you hearing me? Uh, did he text you, honey? Yeah, I showed you he texted me, but you were um, busy getting a massage, and you weren't, didn't want to hear it, so I just kind of blew it off. Lucille, what did I tell uh, you? What did I tell you? Before Mikey sent away his money, what did I tell you? So let me, so a smart man, Johnny, will I be trying to take money from, from Mikey and text Lucille to tell her that someone is trying to take Mikey's money? Would that be a smart thing for me to do? Well, if you're working for him, it would be. Mm -hmm. If I'm mm -hmm. working for who? If you're working with the people trying to scam Mikey, then that, that would be a pretty good thing to do i think are you working no all right listen, listen again if i'm trying to steal mikey's money would i inform you guys that someone is trying to take the money would i put you guys on guard i would i try to hide it from you guys oh uh, pro no probably only if you thought someone else was stealing it which is what you thought right mm -hmm. it wasn't you mm -hmm. no the is that what you thought you was trying to block them from getting it? What's in What's in this for you, Mister Goldstein? I'm I'm trying to figure out why you're doing this. Is this just because you you care so much about the family, or is there something? Nothing in this is for you. nothing. Right. Nobody does I think they have the goodness of their I heart. I care about the family. Listen, the I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be honest with you. Okay, at first, All right. I was doing this out of the love for you, Lucille, and the family. Okay, but after I warned you guys about the money getting stolen and all of that, and you guys didn't listen to me and all of that, I stopped doing what I'm doing for free. So, of course, if, if, if these guys and you guys are, are spending so much money to these cameras and all of that, and I am giving you guys protection because these guys are sending hundreds of spirits and dealerants to you guys, and I'm, I'm here protecting you guys. Might as well, you guys pay me for it or something because I'm doing this for nothing. How much do we owe you okay, so far? Okay, Johnny, 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 this is for important. The, this is important. I just pulled the runes and only one rune came up. The rest of them were reversed and I couldn't read them. For all and I did, so, for all the work I okay, did, Johnny. Okay, can I, can, I, can I please speak? I'm in the middle of speaking. Oh, hold on, let her finish. Yeah, She's doing the a reading. Yeah, rune came up and it came up in the reverse position. And when I asked about you, you would you like to hear what it says? About me or about you can't forever. see me. No, not I have about my you, Johnny, about you. you can't see nothing about me. It indicates it, it shows lies, trickery, and general deceit. Don't believe anything you hear. Oh my gosh. You can't mm -hmm. man. You I can't believe it. I, 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 pulled, I pulled ten runes. I pulled ten runes and only one showed up. Just that one. In reverse. Wow. What does that wow. mean, honey? Is he lying? No, he's not saying. doing nothing. I am the one here. Saying. Listen. Well, how much? Let let's hear how something. much we owe him first uh, for helping Listen, out. Listen, I don't care about the money. Oh, Listen, God, I'm trying to let you guys understand. Johnny, I don't care about the money. Okay? If Lucille was so powerful, why didn't she stop Mikey from sending away the gold and all of that? I was the one that called you guys. We were on vacation. She wasn't spending the entire vacation. Yes, Cash but I spells. still contacted you guys. And but, if you were so but, powerful, Goldstein, why the hell didn't you stop it if you were so powerful? Because you disrespected me. You told me to leave the family alone. You told me to leave you guys alone. What I told else could you I do to leave me and Johnny alone. I said, me and Johnny you told are on me... vacation. We are trying to endure our vacation. Could you please yes, leave me and, you and Johnny Mikey alone? Was fine. You told me Mikey was fine. What's wrong you with told you? me Mikey was fine. You told me Mikey was fine. No babysitting. His uncle is there. Well, you knew he wasn't. You knew he wasn't, right? So why didn't you I do did. your mojo? That's why, it, that's why I stopped it in. That's why more money wasn't sent. And Will, it Will it fail? Will it fail? Did Mikey tell you someone was threatening to blow out the rain? Did Mikey tell you all of that? 
I what? Said, yeah, he told me that he was a uh, scared. Those for his guys life. were blind. I blinded those guys. I blinded those guys. Those guys, they, they were threatening Mikey to blow out his brain just for money. You know what I did? Those guys can't see right now. They can't see nothing. Hmm. What did you they do? They came to Texas. They though? came right at your guy's house. Mikey's not telling you. They came to your guy's, you guys' house. And I had to do a big potion, and those guys were blinded right at your door. Right in your estate, those guys were blinded. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, Mikey didn't mention that. No, he didn't. You they, sure, Mikey? Did Mikey even know they were there? Yes, Mikey. No, they were. They were. They were telling Mikey to give them to give him three hundred thousand in a kettle, and Mikey didn't give it to them because I did the, the spell and the potion. That is why the day when Mikey well, he, he gave it because to I stopped what I was doing because I felt disrespected and I felt that I was doing I was wasting all my energy. Okay, but listen. You guys owe me right now two hundred thousand. Two hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> oh my god, baby, two hundred thousand dollars. How much for you get paid an hour? For crappy magic that doesn't even work. What do you oh, mean magic know. that doesn't even work, Lucille? All right, you protect your family. You're gonna see for yourself, okay? Uh, he did save Mikey's life. I think it's worth it. I did save, save Mikey's life. No, they were going to blow his Mikey if I'm lying. So how you guys want to spend, send, let Mikey send millions, but you won't That's, spend okay, any sorry, money to really save his life? Me off. I remember, Goldstein, before I block your ass, you said, I don't ever want any money from you. I just care about your family. Now you're freaking one of $200,000. What a greedy little shit you are. Listen. Oh, my God. Lucille. Oh, he's feeling this. He felt, he's feeling disrespect. Oh my God. Those guys got the power. They got your gold. They got your money. They got your energy. That's your you energy, Lucille. How could you sleep, Lucille? Like, take, Lucille, take, how could you sleep? These leeches, are, these leeches are just take, take, take. I'm going to have to do a major spell here. I'm going to have to get Lucille. more protection. Lucille, can we just... Listen uh, to me, Lucille. Can we just kind of, can we conclude you in the business instead and let you have a, a Lucy, part uh, of a How much you think, how much you think your son's life is worth? How much you think my job is worth then? You guys, how much you think I deserve for all the work I have been doing? I warned you guys. Why did you, you say you never won any money? Me. Why did you text me? No, because that was out of the love of my heart. Well, I could have paid you a million dollars. One phone you call. You wanted no money. You wanted no money. And now you want Lucille, almost calm a, down. a quarter of a million Lucille. dollars. Johnny, oh. Johnny. Wow. Yeah. Are you listening? Oh. When, when I called, listen, let me, let me ask you something. When I called Lucille and I texted Lucille and said, listen, I think Mikey is about to do something wrong. Call Mikey and tell him to stop. If Lucille had listened to me and just called Mikey and said, listen, the reverend is telling me that you, something is going on. Stop what, what, stop what you're doing. Wouldn't that make a big difference? I'm just asking you. Would it make a big difference if she had listened to you? Is that what you're saying? Yes, and call Mikey and say, Mikey, Reverend is telling me you're, you're up to something. Don't do it. Would that have made a difference? I'm asking you. You would have had your... Well, she did tell me that you called. I just, I didn't know his life was in danger, but yes, I told but... you I appreciate you if you saved his life. But and he never told me. You know, 200,000 is a... That's another thing. All right, listen, steep. I don't you care about the money. You didn't tell me my son's life was in danger. You didn't even bother telling me that. Wow. You don't give a shit. I didn't want to get you uncomfortable. I didn't want to get you uncomfortable. I oh, my God, man. You don't you don't hold back on information like that just because you think you're going to ruin Sweet somebody's I day. You because I already did the potion. I already oh, did shit. the potion. Listen, I'm so powerful. I already did the potion. The guys were blinded. That was out of the way. But the guy named Mr. Beer that was in Mikey's phone, as soon as I hang up, he could text whatever message he wants to text at Ghost. He could send anybody messages. He could text and call and text two guys pretending to be Mikey, pretending to be me. So the text is that you're seeing there, keep Mikey broke, send 100 to, Mar to, to Myra, 50 to, to, to Mari text. Are, are, are camouflage text. There's our fake text sent by a guy named Mr. Beer. And I was trying to explain all of that to you guys, okay? So listen, I don't care about the money or all of that, but at the end of the day, I think I deserve something for all the work I have done. Even wow, just wow. Well, yeah. 
you something, but you said two hundred thousand. So how much do you think it's worth? You tell me. You guys tell me. Well, I was thinking maybe I'll just include you in on the the business when we start in Colorado. You know, give you like a maybe a ten percent cut of the profits. No, or something. I want I want I don't want to involve. I just want to get paid and and protect you guys. I keep you guys on a. You just want to get paid. Belt. Oh, you just want it all. Up. You just wow. want it all. Yes, up front. and I put you guys on a on a protection because I I know still doesn't. We don't, okay, Mr. Goldstein, we don't need we don't need your protection because obviously you suck because if your protection was any good, you would have been able to stop my son from sending those gold bars and you didn't. And the real Ma'am, that you told me to don't do people. anything. You told me your family was fine. Do you want me to read the well, text then message you Well, then you're irresponsible and stupid. Then you're irresponsible and stupid for saying, okay, I'm just going to let it happen. You're not worth a dime. Ma'am, ma'am, you told me, listen, listen to me, listen to me. Well, you you should have you should have told us about Mikey Listen, being I in danger. Listen, I that, so I didn't need to get you guys upset. Okay, I did it for you, Johnny, not for Lucille, because Lucille doesn't know how to speak to people. She's very disrespectful. She doesn't oh, know how to speak to people. Oh, Johnny, I'm done with this guy. The runes are right. Stay away from this guy. You can't talk to her about Lucy. Lucy, like listen that. to me, She's, Lucy. Lucy. Her heart's in the Lucy, right Lucy, I got your fingernail and the hair you needed. I was working for you while you were gone. So I'm going to link up and with I you. And I figured out Both. I don't really need the fingernail and the hair. I don't really need it. Intent and their name is good enough. I don't want you. I don't want you sending body parts. I get you parts. other players, okay? Okay, Lucy, Lucy, I don't want you to think that me and you You're too expensive. Ad- You're too expensive. You want $200,000 for the crap work. No, I don't want, want 200000 No, listen. Lucille, listen. Calm down. Calm down, my loving lady. Remember, you and I are good friends. You, you don't need to... You and I aren't any friends. <laughs> good okay? friends. And, but, but good friends, that's what you just said. I didn't do it for you, for Lucille. I did it for you, Johnny, because I don't like Lucille, but we're good friends. Wow. You Rita, don't you have a girlfriend? Mouth, don't, you? don't you have a girlfriend, Lucille? Lucille, don't you have a girlfriend? You when a your girlfriend, girlfriend never argued before? You you don't have a girlfriend like your your friends that are girls that are females that you go out with to have brunch. Oh, well, she got her sister. Drinks, uh, stuff like that. You don't have female uh, friends. I have friends. They're both. You don't have other female females. friends. So does Johnny. What difference does what the, what difference does it matter what sex they are? I have friends. So don't you have don't you have disagreements and 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 and, and share different ideas at the time? Not like this. Your friends don't Not agree like on a particular say, topic really or a particular like situation. That would end the relationship. That would end, end the friendship. I really don't like you. I think you're disrespectful. Uh, okay, bye bye. Who are these people that were trying to sneak up to the house and for uh, Mikey? Who who were they? Don't, well, that was a guy by the name of David. I, I'm gonna ask him about that later. That was David, David but I blinded the guy. You don't have to worry about it. Are you sure I they were sneaking it, up to the, the house? If you don't believe, if you think I'm lying, I, oh, I am worried about it. Or I blinded the guy. Cause he told me that Listen, he was gonna were, meet him at a were, park, were, were, huh? The guys were at the gate. Mm. Guys were outside. I, I, I did a potion. And I blinded the guy, so nothing happened. They had to leave. Okay, Johnny, Johnny, I gotta tell you this right now. That's very, very bad. He, he Goldstein is really asking for bad shit to come back on him times three. He's using black magic. I thought about it, but I thought, no, that's a bad thing to do. He's doing it. He's at, he's inviting bad shit to come back on him, and I don't want to be associated with him and have that bad shit come back on us. Well, I agree. I don't think we. I don't think we need no bad motive. What did what, what did us. Lucille just say, what did you say, Lucille? Isn't there something bit different you could have done? Maybe called the police or something? I'm, I'm, with the, I'm, I'm, with, I'm with, I am with the spiritual community, okay? I don't do black magic. I pray to the most. You did black magic. Okay, causing one. harm. Okay, all right, all right. Can I say something real quick? If you, if you really understand this, you understand these words. Do no harm. And you harmed these people, making them blind. So you did harm, and that's going to come back on you times three. And I don't want to be around when that happens to you. I don't want anything to do with you. I, I they they weren't physically you. blind. They weren't physically blind. You see, you don't know about the spiritual world. You said they world were. When I say blind, you don't know about the spiritual world. Because when I say blind, oh, they, can't they can't see, see. the person. They can't oh see the person God. I'm protecting. 
So they were just temporarily blinded? They can't blinded? see the person I'm protecting, so they can't see Mikey. They can't do Mikey anything. That's oh, not what I got you. In, the, the intention is blind. Says, the intentions are blind. Well, but he's he's saying that he was they selectively blinded them where they could see, but they just couldn't see the Mikey. Mikey was invisible. He's into also all their, copying all all their their people. Intention. I don't believe him. Remember the runes, Johnny. The runes said he's being deceitful. And 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 oh, not to right. trust anything he's saying, so he's twisting his this words. This isn't, now. aren't you? Are you Jack? Are you Donnie, Jack? Gorgie? Donnie Lucille, Lucille is pardon me. I said, are you the you're the one that Mikey tried to hook up with Gladys, right? Jack what did, I, what did you say? You remember when Mikey tried to hook you up with his aunt Gladys, and y'all got in the argument? You remember Gladys, right? No, I didn't. I didn't. No, I didn't. That wasn't me. This is John Goldstein. I, I have never spoken to you, anyone named Gladys before. No way. You, you're saying you're not the one that I was going to adopt into the family? We were going to go fishing? No, that was the guy by the name of Jack. You're right, Jack McCarthy, mm -hmm. but you're, you're the same person, right? No, I'm not the same person. Why you got the same voice and... Sounds? Everything about you is exactly like Jack. No, because Sounds as like I said, the impersonators, right. those are the same guys. You are Jack. No, you don't. I'm not Jack. Why won't you tell me the truth, Jack? I'm I not mean, you Jack. don't have to be a reverend to be part of the family. I'm not Jack. Because why would I lie and tell you I'm Jack when I'm what not What happened Jack? to Jack? I don't know what happened to Jack. Did you change your name? No, I don't know what happened to Jack. I gotta tell you, I gotta tell you, well, if, I had, if I had a dollar for every time you scan Rich says um, that, that you, why would I lie to you? We would be more rich than, you know, we would have so much more money in our bank account. Why would I lie to you? Why would I lie to you? Why would I lie to you over and over again? You're not mm -hmm. Jack. I... I'm not Jack. I'm not Jack. You, you, you want you, you want to get to Jack? If you, if you guys want to get to Jack, I could get you to Jack. Well, I mean, I don't, what do you mean get to him? I don't. Because I am the spiritual. I'm a spiritual guy. I just. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure you're either Jack or you're his twin brother. Cause y'all sound no, identical. No, I'm not Jack. It's the phone line. It's just the phone line. Okay, Johnny. Oh, it's just because of the phone makes y'all sound the same. Well, you know where Jack was from, right? It must he be was the from phone. Jamaica. Jack? No, I don't know. I don't. So, did you see Jack the other day when you go to Jamaica? Did you call him? No, we we're not friends with Jack because he uh he was working with those scammers. He was working with that Peggy lady and that Alex guy. And according to these messages I'm seeing on Mike's, you know, Mikey's phone, you're working with the same people Jack was working with. So you have to be Jack. So why don't do you? you want me to be Jack? Why do you want me to be Jack so bad? I told you that the guys that have the any depth on the phone. They text and they, they, they set things up to see. They put they, they let you guys see what they want you to see. So you're not seeing the No, you said you were you said you were saying prayers with Mikey and I and it says right here that you and Alex were were saying prayers with Mikey. Well I know He's who a scammer. Alex is. Alex is the one that hung around with mm -hmm. with Jack. So you're hanging around with the same People that Jack was hanging around with, you sound exactly like him. You are a guy Jack, named right? Bear. Listen, yep, a guy named Bear. Mr. Goldstein, right? Listen, and Mr. listen to me. Listen, listen to I me. Can I finish a sentence? All right. I want to say one freaking sentence, and you won't even let me talk. You're the root. All right, say your sentence, Lucille. Birds of a feather flock together. Okay, you can go All on right. now. All right, so let me say my piece now, okay? You yeah, go ahead. I just. Pretty convinced that you are Jack McCarthy, but go I am ahead not if Jack you... McCarthy. I am not. Listen, I'm trying to tell you guys, the person that hacked my key phone, he had that that software has been on my key phone for over a month or two. Okay, I started talking to you guys about a month ago or so. All right, and what happened is that this guy on the phone, you. Lucille, do you remember when I was on the phone and the, 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 the computer voice, the demon voice kept chipping in on the phone? Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I All remember All right, that's that. the guy. Listen, that's the guy. That's the guy near Mr. Bear. So you see how he could just hmm. come while we were talking on the phone, he could just come in on the line and talk. 
Well, what was he doing? Hacking you? He, he's stuff? a hacker and sorcerer, so listen. So listen a what sorcerer? he sorcerer? Well, that's not good. Yeah, so we're this on the Harry, phone. This isn't Harry Potter. This isn't Harry Potter. No, he means he works magic. Yeah, he had no. Mikey under mind control. Listen, he had Mikey under control. Listen to me, guys. Listen to me, guys. Go ahead, Jack. No, I'm listening. This is not Jack, okay? You're always be Jack like to me. It. All right, listen. Listen. Listen to what I'm saying. Um, no, you don't have to get mad. I mean, uh, no, I'm, I not mad. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm just telling you that I'm not right. Jack. I'm just telling you that I'm not Jack. So what I'm trying to explain to you well, guys. Well, if you're not Jack, then, then Jack was, then you were Goldstein pretending to be Jack. I mean, I'm not telling you what to identify as. You can be the Reverend or you can be Jack, but y'all are the same two people. I mean, you even say the same thing. No. I mean, how can you possibly talk exactly like each other and even have the same phrases and not be the same person? You think he was impersonating you or something? Talk to Jack before we ever met you, so we know Jack pretty well. Hell, he almost, he almost was my brother-in-law. Well, unfortunately. So if you know Jack, so if you know Jack, so if you guys know Jack pretty well, you guys will know that this, this, this isn't Jack. If you guys know Jack so good, you will know that this isn't Jack you're speaking with. Okay, why do the runes say you're lying? Uh, why are the runes saying you're being deceitful, Mr. Goldstein? I specifically asked them, can we trust Mr. Goldstein? And it explicitly said no. The room, the only room that popped up said that you were being deceitful. Why? All right, all right. So, all right. I want you to ask the, your room, your room something. Ask it's room, not room. Last week, if you had listened to me, ask them if last week, if you listened to me, you 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 would have saved some money. Can I ask her? Can you do one for me too, honey? Yeah. Do uh, can you ask the rooms if Jack and the Reverend are oh, the same person? Oh, that's a good idea. Okay. Yes, do that. Mm -hmm. Yes, do that. Right, I'm gonna go grab the magic, the eight ball too, honey. I'm gonna spin it. Oh, that thing don't quick. work. You know that. Oh well, hell, it don't work. It works every time. <laughs> you ever use the magic eight ball, um, Reverend or John? So ask this Reverend and Jack is the same person. Jack and Goldstein. Ask your realm. Let me see if your realm is, is is real. I am. I am. Well, I am. You gotta give me a chance. I gotta go find it. it been a while nah, he doesn't okay. mean the magic eight ball. He means the runes. Um, you you mean the runes or the magic eight ball, uh, Reverend? Hello. All right. Well, I'm gonna try it real quick. Probably says it. Probably says try again later. I bet you it says that. I get oh. that so much. Hey, hold on. <clears throat> what did it say? What did it say? Oh my gosh. I guess you're not, Jack. The eight ball says my reply is no. Well, that's it. Okay, I well, I trust the room. Yeah, this more. thing's got Thank a bunch much. of bubbles in it. Don't spin half the time. I don't think the spirits can work in magic if they get a lot of bubbles in in the eight ball. Do one more. Do one more. Do one more. Okay, can I trust Reverend? <clears throat> Goldstein. Yeah. Better not tell you now. What does that mean? Uh oh. Well, it's probably the same as what the runes are going to ready to tell me. Well, I guess they're not. Uh, well, I'll go with your runes, honey. I, this eight balls. Half the time it just don't tell yeah, me. Yeah, half that. the time it says try again. So later. what were you going to do with two hundred thousand dollars, <laughs> Jack? For Watching over Mikey for a couple of days. I'm doing. I'm. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna keep you guys protected for five years. Oh, this is like an advance payment on protection. And yeah, wow. And I'm. And I'm. And I'm also helping the poor and needy. So that's what. That's oh. what I we do. We can do I'm that. Going we can make Africa. donations to that. I'd rather donate to um to meals Sweetheart. on foot. If they, if, uh, Listen, if you give them 200000 This is, this is, this Do is. Do you still have that girlfriend with the little baby that Mikey was talking to? No, oh, no, no. That's not. Oh, Johnny. No. Oh, Johnny. This I, is bad. I'm just asking. This is very uh, bad. What's it say, The runes are telling me, Sonny. Oh, my gosh. It came up Lagarde reversed. 
Hmm. Came up Reversing what? a very, very bad sign. It shows that you're already being misled. Wow. Oh my gosh. We're gonna have to go oh. with, with the runes. Don't lie. Listen, Johnny. Johnny, listen. That's I'm fine. the one. That's I'm fine. the one that saved Mighty Light. If Lucian was so powerful, why didn't she blind those guys? Or listen to me, if she was so because, powerful, okay, why didn't she listen? Because I don't do bad things. I don't want bad to come back on my family time three. That's I didn't I blind do them. I didn't things. blind them. I didn't blind them. I didn't blind then them. If you're lying to us, and it's a good possibility that you never really did do what you're saying you're doing. You didn't help Mikey. So how did I know? How did I know? True, how did I know? That's true. How did I know? True. Mikey didn't tell us he was someone tried to murder. He wasn't hurt. All right, ask Mikey. If Mikey said the guys were threatening him, threatening, threatening, Mikey threatening to told kill me him, that they wanted him to, to meet him down at the park, and he told him, ask "No, him I don't want to do that." Ask him, ask him if they were trying to to to, to, to blow his head out. That's what you need to ask him. If he says they said that to him, you can't say I was lying. Okay, I'm not trying they, to. Okay, Donnie, you know what? That? You know what, Donnie? You know what? You know what's come down to? It's come down to some banishing spells. Banishing spells are just fine. There's no, it doesn't, you know, it's not bad. It's just getting the trash out of our lives. I need to banish every. That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. Stranger. I'm not doing no, nothing you're not evil. Doing That's it. what you're I'm not. doing. Well, then you're doing a shitty job. You're doing a shitty job. Sorry, but no, you, you never listen. Yeah? I stopped because you cursed me out. So I stopped doing my job because you cursed me out. So it's listen, not a job. I need we to get my, my payment. You. We Johnny, listen, you. just pay me off. Pay me off. Do you have him? one of those bells, honey? Him? Johnny. You have one of those bells? What? What? Yes, you let you guys let me in charge. You guys let me in charge. So yeah, oh, those bells. Man. Those bells that he's yeah. ringing. Pay me, pay me the hundred thousand. Pay me the hundred thousand and let me go my way. Pay me the hundred thousand. Let Lucille do all this stuff. A hundred thousand dollars? Oh my God in heaven! I can't believe this guy wants so much money. Wow, it's all about the money. That's all it is, isn't it? It was never about us. It's about the Almighty Dollar. I brought the wow. tree law. I protected my key. Listen, this is what has he to be not. done, and and we're gonna get it done. Okay, Donnie. So you're admitting that you broke the three laws to blind those guys? I didn't blind them. I, they they can see, but they couldn't see my people doing anything. They were blinded to my. Well, you just said you broke the three laws. What do you mean? Yes, by I that? did. Yes, I did. So I need to pay my debt to the spirit. Okay. Okay. So you well, you know what? Okay, no, Johnny. Johnny, he admitted he did it. That means the bad is going to come back on him so much. Three well, times. No. The for you guys. The it's for I you want, guys. I took it for time. you guys. I took it I for you guys. I took it. I took it for you guys. It's just money. Uh, it's just well, money, Goldstein. Lucille, all you had to do was call the uncle. Lucille, all you had to do was call the uncle and stop everything. You you, you throw me off and you cut me out. So I stopped doing what I was doing. So right now, well, guys, you, you let me that off. That means you quit. And you're Johnny, not getting $100,000 let... severance pay. You quit. How much do you think I'm worth then, Lucille? Tell me how much you think the job that I did w was worth. You, you you really don't want me to answer that question. You really don't. You really don't want me I'm to answer Johnny. that question. Johnny, what do you think, Johnny? What do you think I'm worth, Johnny, for us that uh, I did? I don't know. If you, if you did what you said and you saved Mikey's life, then I guess you that's probably uh, priceless. I guess you're worth a few million dollars, probably. But no, you know, he's not are, worth a few million dollars. Are you telling dollars? the truth, though? Is the thing. He's not. I am he's telling the truth. If he Why? saved Mikey's I, life, I, I, I would give all I my money to. I did. I should ask the runes that. That's your right, Johnny. Did he really save Mikey's life? Let's ask the runes. I did. So far. You're batting zero, dude. You're I'm batting gonna zero. Go, I'm going to go. be right back. I'm going to go ask Mikey if someone tried to shoot in the head this week uh, when we were gone. Mm. Well, let's see. Let's go, let's go for the third reading. You want me to do this, Goldstein? Because the first two said it, we, it was deceit and lies. But let's go ahead and go for number three. Are you still there, Mr. Goldstein? Yes, I'm here, my darling. I'm here, my love. So I want you to know that listen i'm not i'm not I, I i am your friend i'm not trying to 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 take advantage of you or nothing okay sweetheart but please believe me i'm not trying to do i was the one that tried from the start tell you about the cell to get your those ingredients and all of that so how could i be turning against you now 
Okay. All right, well, I've got to tell you, I've got to tell you, I've been reading rooms for years, and they're always right. They are never wrong. The rooms are never, you need to ever keep me wrong. In your bosom. You need to keep me near to your heart because I am the only one that was here with you trying to ward off these evil spirits and tell you to get the stage and all of that to do everything that you're doing. So don't turn on me now. I'm sorry, but I trust the rooms. You, you, you need to trust in, in man and mind, okay? You have the power. I'm going to teach you something that the rooms can teach you, okay? The mind of power, the power of the mind, okay? So I'm gonna teach you. Okay, so you can all learn right. From well, me. Okay, you know what's messed up? You know what's messed up? And Ansu came up again, and so did Manaz. Of course, you know that Ansu. That said, that is lies and trickery. I mean, you probably didn't do what Sweet. you said all you right. were doing. Stop! Stop! Also, stop! Stop! Manaz, can I stop! You're doing it wrong. No, it's not a waste. Of, can I speak? This room, the Manaz room, indicates that you can expect no help in your predicament from any fellow human. That means you. It means that you're not helping us. Or if I listen. You're lying to us. All right, listen, those are those books that you read to do what you're doing, those are they're, they're just trying to, 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 to make sales, okay? The real deal, the real power is not in those books you're reading. I know okay? how to read runes. I don't need a book. I'm, the, the I'm real throwing truth, my runes out. The real truth are being hidden. I've been doing this from I was six years old. I was calm and sober, okay? I I I I did wars. You know how I to, did wars with warlock. Do you know what is a warlock? Mhm. Mm okay, I have went to war with warlock before. Okay, and I mm. came out victorious. Well, you know, if I'm here talking to you, you must know I came out victorious. So you don't underestimate my power, okay? And I'm not underestimating don't under, you. You don't either. underestimate my power. You don't underestimate my power. I'm not underestimating power. you. I'm not underestimating. Never. From someone has life, you can never underestimate them. I never do that, okay? Mm, mm. Well, don't yes, underestimate me. Especially yes, my love. You are powerful. You have a little bit of power. Yeah, and no one, I'm, I'm not bad. Okay. Yes, Johnny. What happened, Johnny? He said that the guy, they wanted him to meet him down at the park, and uh, he was worried that, that they uh, might uh, want to do him some harm. But his Uncle Mike was with him, and they just went out and ate instead of meeting up with the people. So they never actually met with anybody, he said. Yes, because I... Because I, I, I told you I blinded your intention. They couldn't and see and my And he said that you and money Alex money called money. him and wanted him to go ahead and send the money to y'all instead of giving it to David. That was the hacker. That was the hacker. That's the same guys that are on the end of that that are sending. Mark, he said he talked to you, though. That, those are the hackers. Did, so that's they how they did your it. voice, too? So that's how they did it. He said okay. he talked to y'all on the phone. Listen, they don't. No, they they use they use the computerized voice that that you guys heard on the phone the the, the time we spoke when Lucy heard the the, the 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 demon voice on the phone. Well, that doesn't sound like that don't sound like you though, did it? They can change their voice. They can change their um, voice and and adapt. Yeah, so they can take Peggy voice. So it's the same person talking as Peggy, the same person talking as as Alex impersonating gold fee. So I wasn't telling Mikey to send any money. That was the hackers on the line. So you're not working. You're not you're not part of uh Alex and uh, Peggy? No, I'm not part of any crew. I'm not part of any crew. I'm at the church daily oh. every day praying Johnny, and chanting Johnny, for you guys. Johnny, Johnny, yeah. Johnny, I'm sorry. We need to stop talking to this man. He's the runes say he's lying. He's already admitted he's doing black magic, and it's going to come back on in time three. And we need to stay away from this guy. We really, really do. My art, your your, your art and your mind is telling you that it's it, it's not true. It's not true. Tell, it tell Johnny to do it. Let let Johnny do it. Johnny heart is clean. Johnny doesn't have any hatred again. Me. So let Johnny re do it and you repeat it and see what it says. Because okay, me and Johnny already, already decided. Me and Johnny already decided. We do everything why together. You it like that. We do everything together. I mean, is it, o is it okay if I throw the runes and see what they say? Well, I guess. I'll, I'll give them a toss and see what happens. Do I need to ask a question in my mind when I do it? Yes, let Johnny do it. 
Yeah, you can ask your question in your mind, yeah. Uh, do I have to say it out loud or? You don't have to, no. Uh, I didn't okay. do it. Well, I think it's only fair to go to if I if I say it out loud so he knows what the question is before you read the runes. Uh, is is Mr. Goldstein being honest with us? Does he really care about his family? Uh, there we go. Uh, all right, scroll them down. What do you What do you think, honey? Well, hold on, I'm picking through them. Why does Aunt and Sue keep keep coming up? Is there up? something on really both confused. sides? Are there stuff on both no, sides well, of these things? Well, the ones that the ones that are um. Rever well, this, the, the reverse answers, but the ones you can't see the symbol, but you don't read those. You only read the ones where the symbol's up. And answers came up again. The rune of deceit. He's being deceitful. That you just you just messed around it. You just messed around it, Lucille. Messed around it? What the hell are you talking about? Messed around it. I, I don't mean, control it. He threw the runes. I just looked at him. I mean, what are you being deceitful about? Are you are you trying to? Hide something from us, Goldstein, that the rooms are no, picking up on? No, I'm not trying to hide anything. Throw it again. Throw it again. Do it again. No, we don't I'm need to. It's three times. Anything. How many times do we have to do this? And how many times does it have to come up that you're being we deceitful? Are, I am the one. So why didn't your your room, your room told you about Mikey and what Mikey was going to do? The uncle because you was have there to ask them. and Mikey you have still to sent the money. Them. I didn't ask them. I didn't ask them. You the should uncle, know this. So, so ask them. If you had listened, I no, want you I'm to done. ask them. All right, listen, Johnny, listen. Tired, Johnny, I, Johnny, I'm I want tired. you to do one more, Johnny. Johnny, right, I want you I'll to do go, one more. Uh, I'll throw him one more time. Let's, uh... Listen, I, what I want you to do, I want you to ask them, if, if did I protect the family any at all? Do that. All right. Did Goldstein protect the family while we were on vacation? What do you, what do you see, sweetie? Well, you only got four. You were only able to throw four. And they're all, um, wow. So the Manaz room, the Manaz room came up again, says you can expect no help in your predicament from this, from this guy. My gosh, I can't believe it. Wow, the same rooms keep coming up over and over again in a bag of over 21 or 26 rooms. What did it say? Really? All these rooms? So we, we can expect no help from the from anybody in our predicament but what, so that means that we can't expect any help from this guy oh well, that's probably why we he lost so much money nobody was was here to help him no you guys are doing listen listen those are just my chances listen to me i'm the real deal here and if i wasn't trying to protect you guys i wouldn't call lucille and tell lucille anything okay oh mr goldstein uh Let's let's give this a rest. Uh, we both had a long day. I just drove all the way to Colorado and back. Um, let get let us give it some th let's give it some thought and let this thing rest a while. I understand. That's why things are doing like that. But listen to me now, Johnny. Well, hurry up, Johnny. I'm Johnny, listen to, to me now. Here. Listen to I'm me tired. now. Okay. Whether or not, Johnny, yeah, I have one too. more thing to say. Okay. I have one more thing to say. All right, whether or not you guys want to admit it, whether or not you guys want to admit it, I did my job, okay? I saved your son's life. I protected you guys while on vacation in a dangerous country. I did my job. I only stopped. I only stopped. All right, well, that's fair enough. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to consider, me and Lucia will talk, and we're going to consider what you, your proposition to get some money for helping the family. I'm not going to rule it out that you, you maybe you deserve that, but I want to talk to Uncle Mike and Mikey first before we make a decision, okay? Well, listen, mm -hmm. yeah. You need to do some but serious Whether or not you guys want to admit it, I know I'm worth what I'm worth. Hey, you don't have to, don't have to argue about it. I said I would, we would give it some thought and consider it. That's, that's all we can do. So can I talk to you in the morning? There's a lot of things going on here that we're not, we're not, we don't know everything that's going on behind the curtain. So give us some time and let us give us some thought. Can you talk to, can I talk to you in the morning, Mikey? Uh, I'm not Mikey, but, um, Mikey? Johnny? Mikey? Johnny, I'm Mr. Mike, Mr. Mike, 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 Mike,
I want to say something to this guy. Do not contact our son, okay? Leave him alone, okay? I did. That, that that's was a, that's a mistake. Be a Listen, good test. Johnny. That will be a good. That, that will Johnny, be a good can, test. can you call me in the morning, out, Johnny? I'm going um, to tell telling you, Goldstein. If I find out you have texted our son, it's all over. We'll block you, and you can just go. Yeah, just, just don't, don't talk to Mikey until. I mean, just don't talk to him. But I need to speak to him, and I'll. I'll talk to you tomorrow after I've had time to talk to Mikey and Uncle Mike. Call me tomorrow morning. Make I, sure I what that went was, on. That was the I, I won't know Listen. nothing in the morning, okay? I won't know nothing in the morning. I don't know right now. Give me I a know, chance to, to look to into you some in the morning, stuff. Okay, with a clear head. I just need to talk to you tomorrow morning after you get some sleep with a clear head. I made a mistake when I said, Mikey, you guys are one family. I made a mistake. You guys are going to kill me for one I don't mistake. give a shit that you called me Mikey. I've been called worse, okay? I just mm -hmm. telling okay, you, good. give me till tomorrow, and I'll give you a call, and we'll, we'll discuss this, and maybe we can figure out something that will work for everybody, all right? All righty. So you have yourself a wonderful night. May God bless you guys. I love you, Johnny. I love you, Lou, still, despite what you might think. I love my team. Uh, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow, okay? Well, the spirits be with you, Reverend. All right. May, may, may my spirit be with you guys and cover you. Oh, I love honey. you, Lucille. Lucille, I love you, Lucille, okay? Hey, when you see Jack, tell him I love him too, okay? I wish we could have gone fishing together. When I see who? When Jack. I see who? When I see Jack. who? Jack. When I... When I see who? Jack. I Jack. won't ever see Jack. I, see. I don't know Jack. Oh, you don't. I thought you said you knew him. Okay, well. I okay. Just was saying, if you see him, tell him I said hi. Cause he was, you like? Do you like Jack? Do you like Jack? I, I like Jack, even though, uh, even though, uh, yeah, Lucille and Gladys didn't care much for him, but I thought he was. I thought he was a kind of a funny I, I can fella. try to find him in the spiritual world. He was a psychopath. I could try to find him he in was the world. Well, I don't think he's dead. You don't have to look in the spiritual world for him. I think he's pretty sure he's alive last time we talked to him. No, I can mm -hmm. evoke his energy. I can evoke his energy, let him think about you. Oh. Well, maybe you can mm -hmm. let him possess you, and I could talk to Jack through you sometime. I mean. No, I don't well, want anyone to talk to me. I could, I could, I could channel, let him, hey. let, let, let you think, let him think about you, and see what happens. But that's about I it. I don't blame you. I don't blame mm -hmm. you. I mean, uh, if I was you, I wouldn't let Jack in you either. I mean, that's what Gladys <laughs> was telling me. She didn't want, she didn't want Glad Jack in her either. Oh, uh, anyways, we'll talk catch you later, Reverend. I, um, this was a very informative conversation. I've learned a lot about a lot of stuff. So, you you have the spirits be with you. And we'll, All right. What time? What time can? What time? What time can I expect your call tomorrow? I don't know. What after time? work tomorrow. After work, I'll have five or six o'clock probably. What time can I expect your call? Five or six o'clock. What time? Pardon me. Five. In the evening or or, or in the morning? Oh, it ain't gonna be in the morning. Morning. Pardon me. You're up at five in the morning. Of course, of course. I go to work from early to, to uh, and you better get your ass to bed. Wow. Pardon me. You better get your you better get your ass to bed. We can have devotion. We can have devotion tomorrow morning because I'm going to be at the church. So we can have. No. No. Uh, I'm only devoted to Lucille. She's the only one I'm devoted to right now. Um, what What time do you wake in the morning, Johnny? I said I'd talk to you after I've talked to Uncle Mike and Mikey. That'll be after work. What time do you wake in the morning for work? Don't you want to have prayers before you go to work? Well, I, I no. Hell no. I want to have some biscuits and gravy. You need to pray yeah, to God I first some, I make some good. So, I make some good sausage, biscuits, and gravy. He wants that and he wants to get on his way. Yeah. Oh. That shit's to die for, I'm telling you. So you're making sausages? You're making sausages for me also, Lucille? Can I have... Three of You're them. Not even no, here, it's no, you use crumbled. You use crumbled sausage in the gravy. That's how it makes crumbled? it good. Crumbled? What do you mean crumbled? What do you mean crumbled sausage? You, 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 ground what, sausage. What do you do? Ground sausage. You cook up the ground sausage in the pan. Then you make the gravy over it, and then you put that over homemade biscuits. 
Yeah. So do you do you, do you, do you they never had sausage and gravy? No. Never? Do you crush Over it out? Biscuits? Do you crush it out? Damn. No. Maybe wow. that's a Texas thing. You ain't been living a good life if you ain't ever had any of her sausage and gravy over biscuits. She makes those cat head biscuits. You ever had the cat head biscuits? They cook them. She lumps them up in the dough. Dough looks like a cat's head whenever it cooks up. We call them cat head biscuits around here. Oh, well, anyways, you're keeping me up. We were supposed to say goodbye about five minutes ago. I'll talk to you tomorrow, okay? Yeah, I want to go to bed. All right, see you, Reverend.